Hello everyone, in this video we will learn how to create a lightning message service in our system. So to begin with that, uh, you need uh, SFDC project in your VS code and inside that this will be the folder. There will be one folder with this force app then main then default. Inside this folder, uh, you need to create one more folder with the name message channels. Uh, make sure that uh, folder name will be message channels. And inside that, again, we need to create one more file with this name, like send message is the message channel name dot message channel hyphen meta dot XML. Uh, make sure this will be the format for your message channel. Otherwise, it will uh, not allow you to save the message channel. So here I created this message channel. So in this message channel, uh, we have to give the master label. This will be nothing but what will appear for your message channel and is exposed it to description, whatever you can give, whatever you want to uh, just display. And this is the required thing, lightning message field. So this field name is something that is very important that make sure that you, we need to use this field in our public component, pop component. So uh, the same field we are going to use it in the pop component. So uh, we will uh, use this the same field. And now let's jump to the LWC component, which I already created for the uh, pop sub uh, example. So here, uh, this is the pop component, which is nothing but from this component, uh, we will send a message and uh, sub component will uh, uh, utilize this message or uh, subscribe the message. So in this pop component, I have not done much. Here, just a lightning input is there. So user, whatever the user will enter, we will uh, 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 capture it in on handle chain. And then on click of send message, uh, we will uh, uh, sub, sub publish the message so in this js file so first thing you need to do you need to sub import that message service publish and message context and then again you need to import your message channel name so message channel name will be something that message channel underscore underscore c so make sure this will be the format to import your message channel and here if you see right on handle change we are getting the input from message uh, input field and then we are storing in this message from user and on click of submit what we are doing publishing the message so this will be the format of the publish message context uh, whatever we are uh, importing and then the, here the message channel name and this whatever the information you are sending it this should be in the form of uh, object again uh, now jump to the sub component so in sub component here we are not doing much we are just uh, displaying the message what we are getting it from the pub component so if you see here right in the js file what you need to do you need to again import the message channel and then here you need to import a subscribe and on load of the page i am just using uh, this subscribe and again here three param parameters will be there context get message and inside the message uh, what we are getting from this message context so here i just put console to see what we are getting it so now let's uh, see uh, these two component we created and in the XML file, you need to make it this is true, is exposed to, and then again target whatever, where all you want to add this component. Let's jump to the demo file. So here I have not added in the org. I just created one lightning application and I have uh, added these two components. Now this is our pop component. The second now is what the sub component. So here, whatever message you will enter, how are you? Suppose I enter this one. So as soon as click on the send message, it will display it here. So that's it about the LMS. Uh, 